Clark? How did you get in here? My trusty ring creates illusions. I thought I'd camp out while your friends emptied out the school. Look, that's the stuff. Surprise. Hmm. I found these in the school armory. Spelled shackles that neutralize a witch's power. And another of Rick's fail safes against supernaturals. Yeah, please, go ahead. Make yourself comfortable. And while you're at it, tell me what the hell you're doing here. I swore to my father I would come back and take you out. But my dad screwed me over yet again. How did he do that? Hmm? He seems like such a lovely supernatural mastermind. <laughs> my form started to break down. He put a ticking clock on me in order to control me. I had to consume people and monsters to stay stable. Well, it didn't work. I burned through my monster food supply and I was still unstable. Once a mud man, always a mud man. But not anymore. I have a new solution. You? Why kill you when I can become a powerful tribrid and stand up to my father once and for all? <sighs> Everybody wants to be a tribrid till they actually have to be a tribrid. Mm. What is that? Mm, a little weapon your friend of me, Josie, helped create today. Now, my consciousness will transfer into the next person I cut. I know I shouldn't gloat, but you screwed me over. And now I can pay back. I'm going to enjoy this. <laughs> You have no blood. How far do you think you can get? Hope. Powerful being, you're not great at hide and seek. Clever girl. 